Jerry Barhead preached that his team just needed to get healthy. The Cajuns suffered their bumps and bruises early on and even took a lump from Little Rock to start Sunbelt play. But since Louisiana has rolled off three straight victories, looking to make it four in a row versus in-state rival ULM. The Cajuns have won the last six meetings with the Lady Warhawks, including a clean 3-0 sweep last season. First quarter, it's Nakia Jones with the outlet pass to Troy Swain. Off the miss, it's Jones, though, owning the underneath and getting the rebound for the bucket. Cajuns up 10-6. Later, Warhawks' Gabriela Cortez is going to drive to the goal and get the bucket to fall and the and one. But as the second quarter winds down, the Cajuns get hot. Here, Malachi, Serafin Williams with the drive and the pull-up, Jay. And then it's Jasmine Thomas, who is dishing it inside to Simone Fields, who fights off two defenders to get the shot up at first, but then she gets her own rebound, showing that persistence pays off. Cajuns win in the halftime up 32-23 and would eventually pull it out 63-55, despite not having an A-plus performance today. The big thing for us is they, they only got four offensive rebounds, and I think that's big for us. When we can keep people off the boards like we did today, I think that's huge. And, you know, get, kept them to one shot and stuff. So uh, all said and done, you know, I'll take that. You know, and it's when you don't play your best and you still get a win, I think that's, uh, that's still important too.